square through there, that angle there. <coughs> if you didn't know, you probably didn't even see it, but the angle of attack on the kite and down, shoddy camera work, sorry guys, down there is um, 15 degrees. Center of gravity on the plane itself is here. When you load your battery, yeah, it varies. But you try and keep center of gravity here, putting FPV gear on it. I've set it up so I can put an FPV camera on it, power everything running down through here. Um, yeah, so yeah, FPV under here, power. But uh, the mast goes down to the aluminium spar that runs right through. So it goes down about 30 mil or so. <clears throat> so you've got that length plus what's in there. So don't forget that length in there. So whatever that length is you measured, add 30, 30 millimetres. That's just pushed in there. Uh, I had to drill a 12 mil hole. There's another plate of... Uh, plywood in there which is real glued into the foam and that goes down through the plywood and into the foam and it's not glued in it's just bolted in I've got a bolt running straight through the, this mast that's 12 mil tubing that one there is 10 mil and that's a um, a, a um, the rear tubing off of a line 450 helicopter tail boom so I've made that adjustable with thumb screws thumb screws the kite comes off pretty easy you've got all your rigging <laughs> that's really important the otherwise your kite's gonna bend up and yeah so fixing point I've moved this back I'll just get the camera right so the fixing point, I've moved, moved it back a bit just to clear uh, wherever the prop is, just to clear the prop. Don't want anything hitting the prop. But when it's all running right, you've got your weight balanced properly and <coughs> it all sorted out, excuse me. It's, it's great. It's probably not the most economical fly. It goes through the batteries, but... Um, it's nice and slow, well, it's not too slow, but now it's got a, a bit of weight on it, um, about two kilos all up, uh, a little bit more with the battery, <clears throat> depends what battery you put in it, so maybe a couple hundred grams more. Um, what else? Uh, I think I'll just, I've put that camera I've put on right there, the little Hawkeye Firefly, a great little camera <clears throat> for the price. I mean, geez, 80 Australian dollars, I think it cost me, 4K stabilisation. You can do FPV through it, but no, so I've got an FPV camera, thanks, CADEX. Um, but I'll just quickly set it up and show you how it sets up. Quickly, I'll pull the camera back a bit. Right, so I'm just going to undo the, it's all tucked away. The transport, which you can just carry it nice and easy to, just like its own handle. So I'm just using back, battery straps. <coughs> Strap the kite up. Uh, the kite is also made myself from a, an old stunt kite I had sitting around, never flown it. So um, I took it apart and used to build the struts. I've extended them a bit, uh, have I? No, I haven't, like the centre one I did. The centre one I had to, it was long enough to be the kite design that I wanted, which is the kite design is the old, old um, hang glider design designed by 
and supposedly Francis Regalo. I think there's a, a few names to it before him actually.